no, no, no. They chose to carry life through. Because they knew that every battle, you have to get ready for it. And the, and the weapon is life. You cannot fight if you're dead, can you? The weapon is life. Even our ancestors, they have to live through us. We are our ancestor manifested. We stand on their shoulders. All these elders that you see and kings that you see here, three kings and an elder and respected elder and high priests. We stand on the shoulder of someone, regardless of the blood, you know, line we come from, but my knowledge is not of my own. It wouldn't be pretentious to believe that because I'm a queen and I'm crowned and I know stuff. Where did, where, where did that come from? <laughs> that came from elders. That came from the kings before me. That came from the mothers before me. The great ones. Like Don, uh, Dr. Ben, Dr. ben Yorkana. You know, the great ones like Marcus Garvey. You know, the great ones like Kim Pavita. The great ones like, like Shikanta Giyok. So we stand on their shoulders. We just continue to sing the tune to wake up our people. Africa is so much to teach us. It's so much to give the world. Because what is African? It's not a place. To be an African is the disposition of your heart. Where is your heart? Who and where do you align with when it comes to your heart? Do you align with fear or do you align with love?